Okay, in this video, I am going to show, hopefully, what I do when I record. Now you will notice there's an amp here. Under the table, there's also a uh, PA system. The PA system actually makes the most noise, but we can hear the hiss. I'm sure it'll come through real good in the video. Now I'm going to turn off the PA system when I do recordings because actually that's like a lot of the hiss. Okay, but there's still going to be a background amount of hiss that you do get unavoidable. So what I do, I record using my computer here. Okay, and I use this little camera here and then I use this little microphone over here. It's a Shure SM58 microphone. And I plug that into a Behringer USB mixer, a little portable mixer. It's got a USB output and that plugs into the That pl plugs into the PC here. Okay. So <laughs> then I record everything at the same time using this Audacity program plus the camera. And then I synchronize it using a clap. And what the clap will do is it will show up here. Let me just record something real quick, show you how it goes. And you can even see the background hiss and everything. When I hit the clap, and you can see it makes a real sharp mark. Well, <coughs> I can synchronize the clap and the clap part on the video. I can also remove the audio track using this program called Movie Maker. And Movie Maker, it's a free program. I don't think Windows, uh, Microsoft even supports it anymore, but it allows you to remove the video, the um, sound from the pictures and allows you to add an MP3 in its place and then export that locally onto your computer um, as an mp4 which you can then download over to YouTube. So this is Movie Maker loading. It takes a while to load. But there it is. Congratulations. It's a free program. Um, So anyways, that's what I use to uh, remove the um, soundtrack from the pictures and then add my own soundtrack and I synchronize the picture of the clapping noise with the uh, clapping noise on the Audacity soundtrack. Now the Audacity soundtrack has the advantage of using noise reduction to take out all of the hiss and um, it also uses this sure microphone instead of the microphone from the uh, cell phone over here and so you get a much better sound especially when it comes to bass and I can demonstrate that pretty easily here too so Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to 
pick up my handy dandy bass here and just play a few notes and you can hear how it really doesn't pick up bass real good with the cell phone. Now it will pick up human voice good. It also will pick up the guitar or ukulele pretty well. But it doesn't pick up the bass real well, so it, uh, you get a lot of low end dropout that way. And that's why I've evolved this way. And it's really simple using the movie maker. You can trim to the exact clap part, and you can trim the audacity program as well to the sharp uh, picture of the of the uh, the sharp clapping sound, and you can synchronize those together. And then once you make a final video, then you can trim that uh, clapping part out. I'm also going to include a link to uh, the first video that I did using this, and it includes the clapping part. So it's pretty interesting, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, can make some uh, higher quality videos and maybe get some of the hiss out. Cause Recording at home, I have air conditioning going and everything else, so there's just no way to get rid of everything unless you're in an expensive studio. So this is what I do. Have a good day.